amazing host and host and he's gonna have many more amazing people on his show yeah. and I just hope that you guys grow with him on his journey and you know we never know how big this is gonna get so yeah. let's just see where you take this take this juice to an oh 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 all right kale ke tuka mo le ke tuka mo le le dipino ke na le ngwa ga tsa tharo ke betsa comedy marapo video la me ke go felo ke batla go tshona le tempo ke batla go tshona khalefo ke spana ka tshata ke tindo 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 ya tindo ya tindo All right, all right, all right. Gap City B Dub, Africa, the rest of the world. Good morning and welcome to the Juice 2.0, your favorite show. Now on the count of three, juicy. One, two, three, juicy. Now today, this morning, we're hanging out with one of these amazing, ginormous media personalities in B Dub and in the whole world, really. She's also an entrepreneur, an influencer, and here's the kicker she's also a singer. And I didn't know about that. I'm like, okay, we got pipes in there. Some vocals come through. But we're going to learn so much more of that. One of those good days. And today on the show, we get to talk with this amazing person. Boys want to be with her and get all up in her junk. And girls want to be her. Because she's so hot. It's like, how hot is she? So hot. She makes a dragon want to retire, man. Okay, TK, too much. Too much. <laughs> So I hope you got your fire extinguishers because stuff is on fire right now. Get on your phones, text us, comment, because Sadie's in the building. Good morning. Welcome to the show. Good morning. How you doing? I'm awesome. I'm awesome. Yeah? Yeah. You said I cut your night short. Yeah, you did. I'm sorry, you man. You did. I'm sorry, man. You know, we need to sacrifice sometimes. You're here. Yeah. You look beautiful, by Thank the way. Thank you. The furs. You know, yeah. go for We can't be killing the animals. Oh, yeah. Don't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're too woke for that, right? <laughs> Thank you very much for making time, man. You are Sadi, and I I think you're you're a person who could have been anywhere in the world, right? This morning, but you decided, uh, let me chill with TK, and yeah. for that, I really, really appreciate you. I appreciate you. How are you feeling this morning? I'm feeling fabulous. I'm yeah. feeling amazing. Feeling really blessed. Yeah. This morning, it's been a rough week, but we bounced back. Has it been a rough week? Yeah, it's been a rough week. I wasn't well this week, but oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I bounced back, so I'm happy. Did you come out, come down with something? Well, hey, guys, <laughs> you guys are gonna think I'm I'm I'm, I'm funny. Yeah. <laughs> What's going so on? I had I had a skin infection, a pimple pop, so it got infected, and then I had to go on this bout of. You had a skin oh, infection. Like, yes. Yo, can you imagine? Oh, you had me a skin infection. That's a. No, it's not contagious. Okay. All right. <laughs> Stay away from me. Stay. <laughs> <laughs> But it's healed now. Absolutely. All right, great, yeah. man. I I I feel like I'm coming down with something. Like my voice is not at the hundred percent, and okay. um, I'm coughing a lot, so I need to go get it checked. Well, you know, before. We, 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 the first thing we're going to think is COVID. Yeah, of course, of course. First thing we're going to think, so. Yeah, and I don't want to I don't wanna mess it up for anyone in the studio, so. No, I'm going to have to go check it right after the building, <laughs> right after the show. I'm going to. So, so, dude, you, you're, you're an amazing person. Thank you. And this is, this is sounding a little bit of a cliche on the show lately because we seem to be bringing these amazing people. And I always have this to say that you are on the show for a reason. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because the Juice 2.0 shares a light on these amazing people that are B-dub, media personality, business, this and that. But for as long as you're amazing, then you qualify to be on the Juice 2.0. Well, But I'm honored. I'm, yeah? Yeah? <laughs> Do you feel like that? That you're an amazing person that people celebrate you like that? I'm just a person trying to make a living. Yeah. I'm just a person just doing what they love. Right, right, And right. And if it comes off as amazing, that's a cherry. Then that's a bonus. Yeah. yeah I yeah. like that. But but let's talk about let's talk about you and your journey becoming Sadi, the mm -hmm. Sadi that we so love in B-dub, right? Yeah. Where does it really start? At what age, what influences that kind of journey? Okay, well, see, what had happened was... <laughs> what had happened was... <laughs> I always knew I would always be in the entertainment space. Oh, yeah. I've always known that I've got a love for it to entertain because right, I love right. seeing people smile right. and enjoy and just bask in the, the, the entertainment and the talent yeah. that you're there to present. Um, so I've always known that, but I've always thought that I'd be known as a singer. Ah, yes. Yeah. Right, right. So, uh, just one day, I'm just kicking it at home, and then I'm watching BTV, and Flavor Dome is finishing. And at that point, I was just like, oh, okay, cool. Uh, what next? And then I saw I saw an advert. Yeah. And they're like, we're looking for the next Flavor Dome presenter. Yeah. 
this and that and that and that. And I'm like, hmm. Jokingly, I post on fa- on Facebook. I'm like, yo, uh, what if I tried this out? Right, right. And then right. they're like, yeah, go ahead. And I'm like, hmm. I know you're all trolls. Out, <laughs> yo, guys. Y'all tried this. This is a trap. This is a trap. Right, then, right, my, right. My cousin was just like, you know what, girl? Go ahead and try it. Yeah. You know, just try you just never know. Yeah. So I applied and I got the call for audition, the invitation to audition. Right, right. And Which yeah, year was this? Sorry. This was 2013. 2013, right, yeah. right. 2013, nine years ago. <laughs> yeah. Can you believe that? It's been it's nine, been nine years. years. It's, it's gone by so fast. Yeah, so, yeah. yes, I auditioned and there were lots of people there. Yeah. And I was like, you're just from Palape. And wow. You came to the city for school. Yeah. And here you are with like millions of people here <laughs> auditioning <laughs> in for city. one of the biggest shows in the country. Right, right. What are you doing? <laughs> and then I was just like, no, nah, let me just wing it. Yeah. I felt so horrible after the first audition, but they absolutely loved it. Oh. And then I got the second call. Yeah. Um, to come and audition. And this time we were shortlisted and yeah. The rest, the rest is history. history I like history. that. I like that, man. So so then we'll talk about Flavor Dom so much more, right? Was yes. that your first, first gig? Absolute first. First gig. First, first, first. And then that's like a setup. It's a prop up to everything else that happened yeah. and continues to happen yeah. right now. Because you're all over the place, man. <laughs> it's like there's a flyer that comes out every weekend for a gig, for an event, for something. So he's got to be on that flyer. Well. Jeez. Yeah. And you've been looking far, fine. <laughs> You had to look. You've been looking fine. <laughs> Do you have an auto for me? You've been looking fine, fine. <laughs> Not right now. Not right now. <laughs> Not right now. You mentioned Palape there. Is this where you spent your childhood? Yeah, that's where I grew up. Oh, um, tell me a little bit about that. I, I grew up in Palape, went to Casa Primary School, and then I went to um, Mapula Junior Secondary School, right. and then I went to Lotani. Right. So, yeah, Palape. 12 years of education. Wow. 17 years of being raised there. Yeah. My parents are still there. Right. Yeah. So when did you then move to Gap City officially? 2009, I packed my bag <laughs> and I was like, I'm never going back. City lights are calling me. Never going back. <laughs> I'm going to leave this house. Yeah. Although I told myself, I'm leaving my mother's house. Right, right. To go and start my own life. Shucks. And I haven't been back. How old were you at this time? I was 17. No. I was 17. 17 years old? Yeah. You were moving to a relative's house, right? Yes. Okay. I went to stay with my cousin. Right, right. Stay with her for a while, and then she helped me get a job. Nice. And I started working corporate for a little bit. Okay. I thought I would be an auditor, guys, at some point. <laughs> I, I found out what an audit. Hey, yo. Did, audit, you have yo. The, did, did you have the education background for it? At that point, I was just training without oh, yeah, the yeah, educational yeah. Ba- background, background because okay. I was actually going to apply for university. Ah. So when they found out that I've, I'd applied for marketing, they were like, but I thought you were going I to be doing accounting. And yeah. then I would, I'm would, i like, nah, guys. Yo, I was, <laughs> yo, yo, accountant. Yeah. I love it. It's you, crazy. Guys. It's crazy. Anything with the numbers, stay away from me. I don't, yo, want, I don't want yo, that. Nah, guys. I don't want that. <laughs> That's a beautiful story, man. So from Palape to Gap City, do you feel at this point that you're a bit uncomfortable? Because the lifestyle is different, right? The lifestyle Palape is different. Palape and Gap City. Gap City too fast. Gap City is fast. Gap City too fast. But I, I make sure that and, I, I take things at my own pace. Right. Own pace, own race. And and your friend was here, your brother, Lungo. Lungo, And yes. I was talking about how Gap City people are fake. So <laughs> clearly, you're coming from Palape, and then if anything that Lungo has to say, and we have to go by it, you come into a place where there's a lot of fake people, mm. right? How does that feel? Are you uncomfortable, or you're like, let's just go? Listen, I've got my circle of people that I deal with, and I'd rather keep them for the rest of my life. Yeah, I, I don't, yeah. I, I don't have, like, a lot of friends. Right. They're, like, acquaintances, right, yes. Right, right, right. But I tend to keep to myself. I like that. I tend to keep to myself. All right, A12 is your time on the Juice 2.0. She's in the building, this media personality that is so incredible, fantastic. You see her every other Friday. Every Friday. Every Friday. On Flavor Dom, and she'd be looking really nice. She'd be doing her job so beautifully. That's why they've kept you for this long, yes? Thank you. I mean, uh, they don't keep people who are not doing a great job. Absolutely. You know what I mean? And you get paid. How much are you getting paid, dude? Uh, it's money. <laughs> but it's money. I thought, I thought you was going to tell us. <laughs> it's money. I thought I excited you enough to it's be like, BWP oh, currency. <laughs>
<laughs> That's what we're going to leave it at. What music are you listening to? Were, well, you, were you driving coming here? Yeah. What track was playing on your stereo? Because <laughs> uh, I needed to jumpstart my morning. I was listening to, to Ganglani. Oh. One of uh, the hottest I'm a piano tracks right now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No doubt. No doubt. Yeah. I like that. So you're an I'm a piano head. Not really. I, I my, you know, my friends are always like, "What do you listen to? What don't you listen <laughs> to?" Actually, because I I listen to a whole lot of there's old school and like there's music from the '60s. Yeah, there's yeah, like, yeah. It's a lot. A whole lot. I like that. So we have some IG questions for you, right? Oh God. We posted and we asked people to uh, ask you a few questions, and Don't so worry. they did. You know, so I need to know if you're ready for all of that. No. I know you're not. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not. But I need to thank people also for our YouTube channel. And uh, the we need to mention this. This video is going to drop on Tuesday, right? Awesome. Stuff. On our YouTube channel. And uh, big shout out going out to my brother, William Lus KRM, whose video is now sitting at 10,000 views. Bum, 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 bum. And it's all because of you guys for checking it out and checking our YouTube channel. Appreciate it so much for this one. Drop it. We're going to break a record with the Saudi video as well. <laughs> so, Lungo had 1,000 views in a day. Wow. You, in Jesus' name. <laughs> two, Prophesy now. In Jesus' name. Prophesy now. 2,000 views in one day <laughs> or even more. But but the question's from IG, yeah? This one is from Hale Sintle. She used to be friends with a girl called Tepiso Mukhetsi. Yeah. Where is she? I loved them from junior school. Oh, Tepi, Tepi right now is actually um, part of Yali. She, she's doing amazing things. Yeah. We lost contact. I mean, it happens when you grow up. And, yeah, yeah, different parts in life. But yeah, Tepi is doing quite well. I saw her that she's going to do, be doing Yali. Yeah. Uh, she was recognized by the American embassy. So beautiful thing. I'm proud of her. I yeah. like that. The next one is from at Sean Navarra who says, no question, God loves her. Oh, right? amen. Hey, amen. Amen, Can Sean. I get an amen, Sean? Oh, thank you. All right. Atang Mudira Dilo says, who is she dating? <laughs> ding, ding. Came with the juice, hey, you know. I like to think, I like to think that he knows. The but I'm dating Usher, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Usher Raymond. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, you got cap. <laughs> Girl, you know I sure ain't even thinking about you right now. Like, he thinking about me. What you about think he was like seven o'clock on the? That was you. Yeah. That was you. Huh? That was you. That was me. It's seven o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go see Sadi. <laughs> Man, okay, you're not gonna give it to us. Uh, no. Are you seeing someone though? <laughs> Legally in Botswana, when you're not married, you're single. So that's where I'll leave it at. Said, come on, come on. Anyway, we'll move right along. I tick the single box when I fill in forms. <laughs> okay. Legal. So if you if you if you're not married, it means you're also not partaking in the conjugals, right? Because <laughs> that's also reserved for the married. Wait, how do mm-hmm. we get there? Mm-hmm. How do we get there? Mm-hmm. He's <laughs> violating the God's law. No, please, no fornication. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I. I've, We'll play a little game called true or false. All right, this most of these questions will come up, right? But I think you're seeing someone. The glow, that that glow is not just for Hello. I mean, I mean you can get glow as you, right? Which is you're a woman, you're independent, you're happy, you're getting this and that for yourself. Hey, but there's glow that comes with uh, uh, morning glory, morning Yo, this, uh, that glow I my plead sister. The fifth. My sister. I plead the fifth a man man. Yeah. I, I'm not going to say anything. Yeah, but I'll tell you this, though. Yeah. Whoever you're seeing, because I know you're seeing someone. Yeah, our gentleman is blessed. <laughs> I'm blessed. Gentlemen, what, what are we, Huh? Right? Tab, what you got to say? <laughs> uh, I do concur. Bro. <laughs> right? <laughs> Bro, wherever you are, whoever you are, man, because so you like your, your, your relationships private. Very. Yeah? Very. So whatever interviews you're going to get to, which interview is actually going to let you to speak about who you see? Or it's never going to happen. With Oprah. With Oprah? Yeah. Hey, sh- <laughs> <laughs> no, okay. the thing is, uh, I, it's none of anybody's business at this point, guys. Right. It and is I, our business, though. No! Okay, Just because no, I'm a public not. figure doesn't mean I'm public property. 
Ooh, hoo, hoo, where's the horns though? <laughs> Say that one more time. Just because you know, I'm a public figure. Doesn't mean I am not public property. I like that. So I really like people that. People will feel entitled to know, but there's certain aspects of my I life really that like I'm, that, dude. I'm not going to just willingly disseminate. Yeah. That's why I protect my family, I protect my friends. I make sure that people know very little yeah. about my circle. I like that. Because I'm protecting them. I like that. Yeah. At Sandy, at Sandy now, at Sandy now. I don't know if I'm pronouncing your your name correctly. How was it working with Lungo? Ah, uh, it was such a vibe. Yeah. Working with Lungo is always fun. Always fun. Like yeah. even when we link up, our synergy is out of this world. I like that. It's out of this world. So who I starts? Mean. Who starts? Who starts? Flavor Dome. Do you start alone or you start together? You mean when we we? Yeah, the duo. The duo. The we duo came together. later. You started together. Yes. This was 2013. 13. Yeah. And Lunga left 20... Yeah, seven, nine, eight, 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 seven, seven, somewhere. Somewhere there. Somewhere there. It's kind of hazy. Yeah. Yeah. What do you feel that you miss about his vibe with you on the show? If you miss anything about his vibe. I just miss having him on the show because oh, yeah. he was a really uh, big part of the show. He was yeah. a great ball of energy. Yeah. He's an amazing television presenter. Yeah, One yeah. of the best in the country. In the country, right, right. And uh, it's an honor to have like worked with someone of that caliber. Yeah. And I was just a newbie. Right, so I've, right. I've, I learned right. quite a lot from him. So if I ever had to ask him and I missed that opportunity and I was looking at the video, I was like, ah, oh, why didn't I ask him this? And this happens to a lot of presenters, right? Mm-hmm. You have a lot of questions, and then when the product comes out, it's like, how I could I not? How could I not ask yeah. that question? If I had to ask Lungo how it was working with you, what do you think he'd have to say about you? I have absolutely no idea. Nah, come on. I don't know. He you probably like. <laughs> <laughs> how does he do it again? <laughs> <laughs> but he'd probably definitely not probably he would definitely appreciate your vibe as well yeah absolutely like yeah. i said our synergy is out of this world i like that like he's just one person that he literally finishes my sentences when oh yeah working so that's who you're seeing <laughs> uh-huh okay okay <laughs> yes Lungo's my boo okay <laughs> <laughs> look i have a question for you yeah so Flavor Dome was your first gig, right? Yeah. Which man? It was a television gig. Yeah. Right. Are you ever interested in this right here? Radio. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Like radio takes things to the next level. It really does. Yeah. Think yeah. on your feet. <sighs> say the right thing. Dude. It's it, it's, it's, it's a, a lot of work. It's a lot of work. It's a challenge. I'm willing to yeah. to try out. I yeah. got you. I got you. Uh, mm-hmm. A couple of dates. Maybe I can teach you here and there. <laughs> dates. Yep. Dates? No. Yeah. You know, radio dates. Ready. Oh, no? Yeah? No? Yeah? What? <laughs> I'm lost. No? Yo. All I'm saying, Sadi, is... See, the voice is down now. All I'm saying is... What Casanova Yana waits? Let me, let me drop the music. <laughs> All I'm saying is... <laughs> it only takes a couple of days to show you what this radio thing is all about. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm sorted. Ouch. Sorry. Jeez. <laughs> early this morning like that? <laughs> you woke me up early. I did. Tit for tat. Tit for tat. It's, it's yeah. cool. It's cool. It's cool. <laughs> but I think, look, in all honesty and being serious, right? Mm. You would you would do amazing because with TV, I think there's more complications there, right? You think so? Tell me about it. Do you think there's more complications in TV? Than, I've been than doing radio? it for nine years. It's It's... it's I, I, I've welcomed all the challenges yeah, that come yeah, through and right. we've learned how to move on if anything goes wrong. Yes, yes, yes. We've yes. learned how to deal with that. But um, I, I I don't take it as a challenge anymore. Yeah. yeah. No. I like that. You're an entrepreneur, right? Mm-hmm. So much to talk about. What does that mean for you as an entrepreneur? What are you busy up and about? What are you busy doing up and about in Gap City that is entrepreneurial? Well, right now I'm focusing primarily on the digital marketing aspect. Dope. Um, so I do a lot of influencing, as you've mentioned. Yes, yes. And I'm helping some companies with their corporate strategies, their their strategies for digital marketing. Yes. 
Yeah, so product placement and um, brand positioning. Mm. So we find ways of making sure that the brand is aligned and communicated in a good way to the people. Lovely. Yeah. You think you can help me out? With what? With brand what what? Yeah, I- I'll send you an invoice. Because I'm trying to... Ish, but you look like you're expensive though. I'll send you an, invi- an invoice. Don't worry. Ah. You can pay. I can try. <laughs> Let me see the invoice first. <laughs> Let me send you. Let me see. Let me send you the invoice. All right. So 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 then that becomes part of your brand as well. Yeah. And then the company. Yeah. You're the CEO at BSD. Yeah. Global. That's. Yeah. How does it feel being a CEO of your own thing, owning your own thing? <laughs> That's, That's what it means, right? Question. That's what it means, right? Uh, my best friend, yeah. she loves, uh, every time we meet up with people, I'll be like, oh, this is my best friend. She's the CEO of this and this. And she'll be like, girl, I don't even feel like a CEO. I'm just into this and this and this. Right, right. So when you ask me that question, um, it's it's great to know that I own this baby. Yeah, yeah. And it's my baby. I like that. And I'm growing this baby into yeah. something. So uh, it's quite exciting. It's really exciting. I'm hoping to see BSD Global global yeah. at some point. And you're going to have TK as part of your team. Okay. If I pay for that invoice, I hope you get my brand out there. You know what I mean? Make me shine. I, you will shine. Huh? You will shine. You sure? Yeah. All right. So, 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 um, what did I need to ask you? Yes, this question. Is there pressure that comes with you being Sadi? Right? You're walking in the streets, you're getting out, you're doing this and that. Is there a pressure that tries to keep you within the context of what people expect to see when you're out there or you just like you know what my own life my own pace if i influence you it's all good if i don't whatever the only person i need to impress is myself so no pressure at all no pressure yeah yeah no pressure um the moment you start focusing on what other people say what other people do yeah or think about you then that's when you lose yourself. Right, right. So right. ultimately, I'm, I'm, I'm my only competition. I'm my only. That's beautiful. Priority. That's beautiful. Yeah. I like that. Eight thirty-four is your time. We're gonna break into a song, and then when we come back, we're gonna play a game: free association, true or false. Yeah. Yeah. It's getting hot. <laughs> it's getting hot. The Juice 2.0. Thank you very much for stopping by. You're amazing. Remember, text us on 104962. Call us on 395 For your WhatsApps, plus 267 395 Also, because you're here now, drop that comment and let's have a good time. You want to ask Sadie a question? Do it. Don't hesitate. She's in the building. She don't bite. Unless she has to. <laughs> Free association. All right, let's go. So all you have to say is true or false, right? On a statement that I'm going to give you. <laughs> I try to be nice because apparently I'm always very, very anyway. anyway. <laughs> so true or false, you're 22 years old. <laughs> She's like, what? True. True. Oh, I'm lying. <laughs> I turned 30 this year. You turned 30? Yeah. Nah, come I on. Swear. Dude, you're 30. 30, 30. Dirty. Welcome to the dirty 30. What's the dirtiest 30 thing that you're about to do? That you've done already? Nothing. Yeah. You know what? When I invited you to the Juice 2.0, eh? you I, sh- this, I'm just- I should have mentioned ice. <laughs> so no dirty 30 so far. <laughs> Nothing dirty. All right. Just 30. I'll teach you some dirty th- dirty things. Like what? Paintball? Nah. <laughs> Mudslinging? Oh, oh, it gets dirtier than that. Oh, God. It gets dirtier. Oh, Lord. If you give me a few dates. <laughs> should I? Dates? T- yeah. Teach you dirty. 18, 19, 20, 20. 30. <laughs> You're too stupid. You know that. You're stupid. I'm the silliest person you could ever meet. But I like that though. Silly <laughs> wins all the time. Anyway, yes. your bigger thrill is hosting other events than hosting Flavor Dome. False. False. Flavor Dome is the biggest thrill. It's my home. I love, love that. Love it. When you get married, Sadi, and I say when because you want to get married someday. Absolutely. All right. Beautiful. When you get married, you will mostly be a cooking wife than a takeout wife. (laughs) (laughs) My brother, I take back my words, eh? I said you were blessed, huh? My brother, I take back my words, eh? (laughs) Okay, there's no Nazi in the middle. There's no Nazi in the middle. Can't I say? It's true or false now? Uh Uh-huh. Guys... No, it's not necessarily going to be like take out all the time. Right. Okay, I'm justifying. But anyway, the thing is, right. I work 
Yeah. I work. Yeah. And he works as well. Yes. So when we get home, we're tired. So now I will just say we'll have home cooked meals, but somebody will have to do it. No, oh, yeah. A probably auntie. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Your body count is two. True. True. It's <laughs> like let's, let's get to the lowest. True. <laughs> True, Tige. I Move. tried to say it with the with the. <laughs> True. I tried to keep my straight my, my face straight. It's two. It's two. Oh yeah. Two. There we go. <laughs> Your ideal boyfriend is average height, light skinned, and a little on the chubby side with a lot of money. Why like there's some things I don't can I can I okay. You yeah. said average height. Yep. Light skinned. Yep. No. 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 Uh-huh. No. No light skin. No. You like them dark? Yes. I okay. I'm the yellow bone in the relationship. Ah, so no competing for that. Mm. Yeah, that's yours. <laughs> <laughs> With a lot of money. Absolutely. I mean, hey, the way you say it, absolutely right there. Absolutely. <laughs> but love knows no bounds, right? It's, it's love even if there's absolutely. no money. Well, it, it should be a little money. <laughs> like you wouldn't, you wouldn't get with anybody who you feel like you're attracted to, you're feeling so much, but they don't have money at all? DK. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> got you. I got you. It's fine. It's fine. Let's move right along. Uh, your celebrity crush is TK. Wolf. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Which one? Which TK? Yeah, that was the question I was expecting. But anyway, let's move. <laughs> <laughs> the movie you would watch forever and never get bored is The Notebook. False. False. Which movie would you have? White Chicks. White Chicks. Where's the trail? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's on the dance floor. Love that movie, by the way. All right. The one song I'd listen to forever and never get bored is... Pretty Hurts by Beyonce. Love Beyonce, but no. No? It's too sad for me. Okay, so which one is yours? <laughs> one song I'll listen to forever. Forever. It never, never, ever get A bored. A group called Eternal featuring B.B. Winans. Uh, it's called I Wanna Be. It's a song I think it's I wanna from be like, the one yes. da, 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 I think it was da, 1996 da, 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 or something. I Wanna Be. Do you know that song was about God? <laughs> well. You do, yeah. It's a beautiful, and I think I love the craftiness in it. You know that they they would they would sing about God, and when you hear it, you would think they're singing about yeah another person. But like, that's the thing about R and B; you can take a song yeah. that talks about yeah, and then turn it into a worship song. Right, right. Yeah, R and B, but it's just not seven o'clock in the morning, though. Well, not that one. Not Usher. <laughs> yeah. That was meant for me. That song was yeah, specifically for, for me. Right. Yeah. I believe you, Sadi. Tailored. Tailored. Sure. When you use the word tailored, though, it's like he's making a point. Get it right. It was meant for me. <laughs> the worst date you have ever been on was with a guy who couldn't pay for the bill. False. False. Yeah. What was the worst? Conversation, bragging. Hey. Hey, we be doing that sometimes, though, right? Ish, 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 guys. Can you not? What do you think? I think, I think sometimes it's... You know what? Let me not get into it. But I think it's 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 a presupposition that actually should hurt the next person they're sitting to, mm. because I think when they say that, they think that you expect them to say that thing. Well, you, you get it. I, you get I, it. I, like if I'm sitting with you, right? Yeah. And I'm bragging about my cars. I'm thinking that this girl wants to hear about my cars, and so I'm dumbing it down on your expectations. I mean, honestly, can't we just talk about other things? <laughs> You know, that makes sense. Right, right, right. Your ambition. Exactly. Your principle. Just be normal. Just be, yes, just yeah. be normal. Yeah, but, no. the per, but the person you're with now had it did the right way, right? Absolutely. Now, look at just smiled. Oh, just like, absolutely. absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> All right, let's move right along. My longest romantic relationship was two years. False. False. Yeah. How long was your longest? Three. Three years. Yeah. Three is a charm. My favorite body feature is my booty. <laughs> dun, 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 Guys, dun, y'all are going to think I'm vain. I love all of myself. But? <laughs> but the butt. But the butt. <laughs> 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 
Hey, I like that. I like that word but play. The but. but the but. <laughs> All right, we appreciate it. You have used your face card to get what you wanted in the past. Which past? Like in the past, you've used your 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 face card to get <laughs> what you wanted. <laughs> You see, that's a life, true. That's a true. <laughs> you see, in life, uh huh. When it rains outside, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I already know where this is going, though. I really do. No, true. <laughs> true. Yeah. Yeah. Same here. <laughs> I have. One of my bad habits is farting in public. <laughs> Confess. <laughs> this is your last chance. The world is coming to an end. Confess. True. No, I don't fart in public. You fart in private? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Keep it to myself. <laughs> Keep it to myself. You prefer your romantic... Oh, we, we asked about this. Your romantic uh, love, life, privacy. Yeah. You once had a one-night stand and caught feelings. No. No. So that's false. False. All right. I don't have a beef with anyone in the industry. No. False. Okay. True, true, actually. True, that that yeah. is true, right? True, true, true. You have a tattoo you regret? No. Okay. So you true? So, true. No, false. 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 All right. You once got so drunk you blacked out. I don't black out. Yeah? False. False. <laughs> I don't black out. You once got arrested. False. False. Oh, you clean clean, aren't you? That's how we keep it. Yeah, that's how we get a clean clean. You once hooked up with someone in your DMs. No comment. No comment. <laughs> Jesus. You know you're not coming back to this show, right? You I'm know that, right? You, you nice. I am coming back. Oh my god. You don't mind having a baby by Burner Boy. Let's see. I don't think of him in that way. I feel like he would be more of a good friend. Yeah. So having a baby with no. Okay. Mm -mm. So false. False. You have this amazing event happening this August with Vusi Tembe Choir. Yes! Are you excited so about excited. that? I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm very excited because we're going to be celebrating <coughs> the fact that we are post-COVID. Yes. And uh, businesses have struggled. Some yes. have actually had to close down because of COVID. Right. Some are still thriving. Yeah. And we are just trying to say, you know what? Yeah. We've been through a lot. So here's just a little bit of encouragement yeah. in order for you to keep going. Right, right. So, yes. We're going to be having Pussy Temper Choir. There's Dope. going to be um, a session where yes. he's going to be sharing uh, his input. Mm -hmm. And then in the evening, we got Mikasa Yay. and some local, some local um, artists that are going to be performing. Yeah. So I'm going to be hosting the, the cocktail evening, of the cocktail course. part of it. Yeah. Quite excited. I wonder what kind of dress you're going to put on for that event. Well, Jeez. just stay tuned. It's going to be it's going to be hot, that's for sure. <laughs> so if I have lady friends that want to shoot their shot on Vusi Temple Choir, should I rely on you for that? No, no? Don't. Okay. Don't. Ladies, sorry. <laughs> it's not happening. I'm the worst Cupid. Yeah? I'm the worst. You've never played Cupid for your friends? I tried and then, hey, hey, no, no Cupid <laughs> no more. I don't Cupid no more. You don't Cupid no more? Nope. Sadi, it's been such an honor, man. Such a privilege to chill with you. You're actually quite a vibe. This is the first time I'm chilling with you like this. <laughs> Thank you You're so much. You're such for a vibe. Me. I like stupid people. I like very, very <laughs> free people because that's that's who I am as well. You know yeah. what I mean? Because why so serious? You know? Why so ooh, ooh, serious? ooh. Been to the new mall? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Okay. Um, I, I prefer. I'm gonna probably go there. Like maybe like on a Wednesday oh, about yeah. 9 a.m. Right, right. When there are not a lot of people. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. I wish you nothing but the best. Thank you. Uh, but we have a phone call here. Do they want to talk to you guys with me live on air? And we lost them. Try to call us, but we're already saying our goodbyes. Any last words before you say ta-da? Well, I just want to say believe in yourself, love yep. yourself, put yourself first. We're going through a very difficult time. Yep. Inflation, yep. depression, dude, all of that. All the issues. But I just want to encourage all of you to make sure that you put your mental health uh, first. Yes. Because we are dealing with a lot. So please go out, talk to people, deal with the situation. We love you. You are loved. You are needed. And I wish you all the best. Sadie signing out. Love you so much. Thank you. And uh, until next time that we chill. Absolutely. One time. <laughs> What's going on, YouTube? My name is TK of the Juice 2.0. 
I'm just here to say thank you very much for checking our video and click subscribe, like, and the notification button for more content just like that.